What's going on everyone? DJ Fitness D News Reviews reporting to you from the world's only FDA proof bunker and together with me LA Confidential The Street Pre-Workout The Street People Yeah people listen listen by the way I'm telling you in advance forgive me for being a bit buzzed yeah Listen, people, I'm going to take you through the uh, label of this thing. Yeah, label, label. And then I'm actually going to share with you my personal experience using this one over the last three weeks, really. And then, towards the end of the video, as usual on this channel, I'm going to give you my final verdict. Who is this one for? And all I'm going to ask in return, by the way, for this entire magnificent journey. You know it, people. Hit that like button. Okay, people, so, you know, we're blessed. We are blessed to be living in a world where every freaking 10 minutes someone comes out of nowhere and lets us experiment with some steam junkiness. Yeah, people, steam junkiness. You know, I've been thinking, by the way, I've been thinking. All this thing with pre-workouts, you know, a lot of time people ask me, hey, what's the most important supplements? Let's do a review about the most important supplements. I have to tell you that for me, for me personally, the most important supplement is a pre-workout. And it's not because it's good for your body, it's good for... Well, for me, this is part of my lifting experience. I just lift better. I put more into it. I work out harder. I feel better about myself with a good pre-workout. Now I understand, maybe protein powders are more important for your gains. Really. Maybe, I don't know what, taking some multivitamin is definitely better to your health than a steam junkie pre-workout. But for me, a good pre-workout that puts you in the zone, that gets your ass moving, that gets you focused, that gets you that post-workout buzz, is more important than any other supplement because my lifestyle is about staying healthy and lifting. I lift for the head more than for the muscles at this point in my life. And then pre-workouts is just such a blessing in this regard. Anyway, people, <laughs> anyway, listen, people. So the LA Confidential, the street, out of nowhere, new brand, really nice well, very well done i can let me show you the other uh, i have the other two tubs here like look at this thing this is really really nice I, had, uh, I have a few samples of this ones so i tried them instead of opening them up anyway people anyway so the street la confidential um really nice design obviously they've done out of nowhere came out of nowhere and this looks really really nice looks amazing actually anyway people listen to this from a label perspective, they have one scoop, two scoops. Two scoops is 16.26 uh, grams. I don't like... Anyway, people, the one scoop, two scoop, I guess it's for... I don't know who is this for. I'm not trying... I'm trying to figure out if this is mostly to confuse you that there's 40 servings with one scoop or to tell you that you can start slower. But because you can actually put, hey, it's one scoop and start with half a scoop. And anyway, we're the two scoops channel here anyway. Two scoops, people. Okay, let's start. So they have, look at this, Wake Win Repeat Performance Blend. Yeah, that's a performance blend here. Citrulline at 6 grams, 2 scoops, right? 6 grams, that's good. Beta alanine at 3 grams. Beta alanine, we like it for the tingling. Yeah, we like the tingling here on the channel. You know, the buzz that comes in, hopefully like 10 minutes in, and starts getting you into the zone. You know that something is happening. If you don't like the tingling, listen, listen, I, I just, if you're new here, I want you to focus really hard. If you don't like the tingling, you're not going to be a very good friend of this channel. We like the tingling here. You can stay. You can like the video. You can whatever. You, 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 can, be, you can be around the channel. We're just not going to be very good friends. We like the tingling. We just like them. It's supposed also to help you, by the way, with endurance and shit like that. Then you have GBB at 10 milligrams. So GBB is uh, one of these ingredients that if you put it in a good amount and the way that it interacts with the rest of the stuff, you're going to sweat balls. That's the idea here. Okay, let's look at the uh, Focus Blend Street Smart Mind Muscle Connection, whatever. Like, okay, L tyrosine at 2 grams, sell out of the tyrosine. Then I have 2 amino and Araya. I love this thing. Listen, 2 amino DMHA at 200 milligrams, Araya at 200 milligrams. That combo, that combo, 200 and 200, 
really depends again on the quality of the ingredients because labels are just labels you never know if they actually put it in here you never know the quality of the ingredients and you never know how things come together but generally speaking if you have a good quality source of dmha and araya these two combo of these two at 200 milligrams exactly with a uh, caffeine and a bunch of other stuff man that is sort of that steam junkie entry point where things just a lot of the times from history i'm talking from history come together anyway then they have caffeine at 400 milligrams. That's a good amount of caffeine. They have mega synephrine at 70 milligrams. It's uh, basically synephrine HCL. It's a combo of synephrine HCL and isopropyl synephrine. I like this one. I have very good experience with the mega synephrine. That is a good ingredient for some sort of natural thermogenic energy. But again, labels are just labels. We have 400 milligrams of caffeine. We have this mega synephrine shit. We have the 200 milligrams of amino and uh, two amino and araya. Listen, but then they have ordinate at 40 milligrams. Love hordenin. Araya Genesis is just better with hordenin. 50, 40 milligrams, 50 milligrams, sometimes 70 milligrams. Really depends. You never know exactly. But with 40 milligrams, it just comes together really nice. And then they have this combo of Yohimbin HCL and Alpha Yo. Love this combo. Love it, and I love it at these amounts: two milligrams and one milligram. But you don't need more than one milligram of alpha yo to get that good benefit of alpha yo without side effects. And the co combination with your himbin HCL is uh, is usually beautiful. Now, if you're super sensitive to alpha yo, you might feel one milligrams. But I have to tell you, one milligram is good for even for people who are sensitive to alpha yo usually. So listen, people, let me tell you something. Labels are just fucking labels. You sure? You understand? You understand, right? It's been proven. Stanford, MIT, they've, been, they've done research. They came to the FDA-proof bunker and done the research even here. And they discovered that labels are just fucking labels. Doesn't mean shit. What you can know from a label, and this I'll tell you, is that whoever put this label here is not only a great designer, he also understands about ingredients in a steam junkie pre-workout. This is not a stupid label. Sometimes we look at these labels and say, what the fuck did they mean? This is a very well thought of label. From an ingredient list perspective, from the quantity of the ingredients, from synergistics type, at least on label, what's supposed to happen. This is a sm some smart ass people at least wrote the label. But still labels are just labels because they can put this together and maybe the manufacturer wouldn't put this shit in and they can put this together and maybe the quality of the ingredient wasn't well. Anyway, but someone that understands labels put this together. Okay, people, let's get into the experience. So I actually tried all three flavors of these things. It's really hard to understand what the hell these flavors are. Okay, people, so the flavor, they have three flavors, LA Confidential, H-Town Drunk, H-Town Drunk, I guess it's like LA type shit. And then I think the third one, the red one is, what is it? Big Apple, Big Apple. Okay, yeah. So I tried all three flavors. This one I actually tried the tub itself uh, a bunch of times and I tried two samples each of the uh, the two other flavors. They're all good. They're all solid. They're all, I don't know if they even relate to the flavor. I can't even remember the fucking Big Apple tastes like apple. I don't remember anything. I can just tell you they're all were okay. There was to the point that it, it just really didn't matter. Now on a scale of one to ten, your scales of 1 to 10 for fucking flavors. New company you never heard of. All this shit, 2 amino, Araya, all sorts of bullshit that you would never put in your body. You're putting this in your body and you want to scale for 1 to 10 for flavors. Fuck you for scales for 1 to 2 for flavors. You're making me mad. Anyway, they're all good flavors. Enough is enough with this bullshit. Let's get into the experience, people. Okay, people, so let me tell you this. So I've tried this one. A bunch of times a lot of times a lot of times I'm talking probably all together between two two four like eight times eight times and the experience I'm gonna share with you it is very consistent across the end eight times very consistent yes the beta alien tingling comes in it comes in slow it's not very hard hitting beta alien tingling it's there you feel like a beta alien buzz more than anything else and it's gonna last you for a bit but it's not very apparent beta alien tingling so it, it, it is what it is, right? As far as the energy, this is one of these pre-workouts. Listen, people, listen. This shit, let me just tell you, the, the buzz, I'm going to tell you how the buzz is going to get. The buzz on this one is real. This is a buzz pre-workout. And you, you people, you steam junkie knows. When I say this is a buzz pre-workout, you know what I mean, right? You know what I mean. That the pre-workout that gets you buzzed. This is a buzz pre-workout. Now, 
you're it's gonna hit you the energy is gonna hit you at like 20 minutes in i'm gonna say it's not one of these fast hitters 20 minutes in and it's gonna crawl on you you're gonna get the caffeine energy and then it's gonna go up now you're gonna feel that buzziness climbing on you right you're gonna start feeling that buzziness probably 20 30 minutes in climbing but what i really like about this one the buzziness goes up and up and up and people listen then it goes up and up and then it goes up and up and up and up and up and it continues to fucking go up actually people this is one of these crazy ass pre-workouts where the buzz keeps on climbing post fucking workout yeah this uh, i'm now i mean i know it's crazy i'm like three hours after i took it i'm fucking probably more buzzed than i was an hour and a half ago and an hour and a half ago i was buzzed this is one of these buzz pre-workouts you're gonna get the energy kick is solid you're gonna get all the energy you need it's not heart rate energy it's not craziness the alpha yo by the way is super you're only getting the good effects of alpha yo you're not getting any zero side effect i had zero literally zero side effect the energy is just on the money it's not crazy ass steam junkie energy heart rate going up if this is what you like if you want to wake up from the dead this is not it it's exactly the amount of energy you need it's exactly what you need nothing less nothing more anyway so the energy comes up and the energy is quite consistent this is really interesting the energy so the energy doesn't do this the buzziness level, that being buzzed, right? That good feeling of motivational well-being, you mood like great mood, not you for a great mood and focus. Buzz, buzz. You guys know what I mean with buzz. That shit goes up and up and up and up and up. Energy is like this. So if I needed to chart the graph for this shit, it would be energy goes like this, and then like plateaus until it fades out like maybe four or five hours later buzz goes like this and goes forever so listen people i personally and there's zero side effects from an energy perspective now as far as the pumps they're mediocre i would say this is sort of i want to say these are sort of the pumps that you would expect from a steam junkie pre-workout right you're not expecting too much you want them to be there but they're not too much you can definitely add some pure pump formula to this like blood sport or fsu by uh, inspired check out my reviews below but like a pure pump formula unflavored just add to this shit it's gonna be fine you're gonna be fine if you don't want it you, you don't have to take it the pumps are like i said not not the highlight of the show here but the steam junkiness experience if, if what i just described if you if you like buzz pre-workouts and you actually want to be buzzed post-workout because i gotta tell you this is gonna get you going around like man a few good hours after the workout buzz just just in that good zone of buzziness i really like it and i'm telling you like i said this the buzziness does not stop I, man i really like what they've you know this is one of these pre-workouts that you say hey if they put super high quality ingredients into this and they actually put what they say on label this is what the label would feel like this is fucking what the labels feels like really like there's just you know, this comes in this world of M2s, Decimate, uh, Helios, like this buzz, good buzz, but the buzz on this thing is intense. This is the good old day buzz, people. Good old day buzz. And it, I, man, I, I just like the street. I like it. I really like it. There's, you're gonna like it, people. You're gonna like it. Get ready to fly. Listen, people. This is what it is. It is what it is. As far as where you can find them, I'm going to link below to the page on Fitness Deals where you can find the latest deals from all over the web. Deals, coupons, you can go. Save time, save money while supporting the channel. Listen, people. If this review was helpful, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel to see more like this. Because this is what we do here, people. This is what we do here, right here from the streets. And the world's only FDA-proof bungalow. We give you our honest, unbiased fucking opinion.